For the last 25 years, this husband-wife duo have been capturing the spirit of New York City. They are photographers turned historians, and they also happen to be my tour guides for the day. This is James and Carla Murray and Hudson, our other tour guide for the day. So you guys are the creative forces behind one of my favorite Instagram accounts, James and Carla, where you guys photograph old signs and old storefronts. And, and to me, those are the stores that really make New York, New York. How did you get into this? Well, we're here in the East Village and we've been residents of the East Village for over 22 years. And um, we just love typography and lettering and we love the hand painted signs and the big neon signs. And we started seeing that they were disappearing. So we started documenting them to preserve them. Tell me a little bit more about this location. Yeah, this, this location is the reason that the East Village got electricity. It predates when the whole neighborhood had power. Now, you guys said that this store is connected with another store down the block. Yeah, exactly. they have like a symbiotic relationship. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, so we just walked a couple of steps to? To Russo's, and Russo's has been here since 1908. We've um, interviewed the owner. Um, you know, he told us that he wouldn't be here if they raised his rent too high because he doesn't own the building, but he has a symbiotic relationship with the Nero, so he, a lot of his customers come here to get their homemade mozzarella and pasta, and then they'll go to get some sweets. All right, before we go on to our next, I say we go get some cannolis and maybe a little fresh mozzarella for the road. Perfect. You know, Perfect. You know, yes. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so I'm very lucky because I'm getting treated to a solo tour, but you guys do offer walking tours, right? Yes, definitely in the spring once the weather gets warmer. We'll announce it on our Instagram. All right, I love it. Okay, so now, James, you have brought me to another location that you have photographed, which Yeah, right is... now we're outside of Hoselka Coffee Shop. They've been here since 1954, but it started out was more of like a newsstand, but when then the current owner, Tom Bouchard, took over with his son, Jason, is now part of it, they decide to focus on the food. So we are three for three right now. We've got another stop. Perfect, yep. let's go. Okay, Hudson, you ready? Come He's on. ready. Come He's on. ready, good boy. Something has changed within me after spending the day with you guys. We're walking down the block, and whenever I stop and see something like this beautiful store that we're in front of, now I'm curious about it. We're in front of Block Drug Stores, and it's the oldest business that we're visiting today because it's been here since 1885, and it has a gorgeous neon sign, and that's what attracted to us in the first place. And it wraps around the corner, and it looks really beautiful at night when it's lit up. So James, I'm going to ask you, when people are walking around the city and they stop and they see stores like this, what do you want them to do? What do you hope they take away? Oh, we want them to go in and shop there. Go in, make a friend. Talk to the owner, you're going to have a wonderful time. James and Carla, it is fantastic. I feel like I've learned so much today. I hope to learn more with each post. Oh, Thanks. thank you so much. <laughs> it's thank been a you. pleasure.